What's the difference between someone who wins that life and someone who loses? And that's a thought that's worth running through your mind. That's something worth getting curious about if you want to win. What separates us? What is it that makes us different from each other? Let me tell you a secret. Life responds to deserve. Life responds to what you deserve. Life doesn't respond to what you want. Life doesn't respond to what you need. Life responds to what you deserve. And so if you want more, the only way to get it is to deserve more. How do you deserve more? You take action. You take the right action. You take the action that's required of you, that you know is required of you, in order to get to where you want to be, in order to get what you want. Now the best thing is, you don't have to be great to get started. You can make up what you lack in talent right now with boost and effort and giving more and working harder and fighting further and giving more than everyone else. If you can stay consistent enough, if you can stay patient with your passion, if you can stay in the game for long enough, you will win. If you keep trying, you keep working on it day and night, you give it all you got, you will make it. Don't move from side to side with every distraction that comes up. Don't let it catch you. Don't let it take you away from your purpose. Stay on the road to success. Stay on the road to winning. Stay on the road that you need to stay on to get what you want. That's the only way. You stick through no matter what forever until you get the results that you want. You don't give up when you're halfway through. When you're halfway through and the plant is just about to break through the ground, do you give up? No! If you care about it, if you're passionate about it, if it is what you truly love to do, how long do you keep going before you give up? Now let me ask you a question. What do you deserve? What do you deserve? You don't even have to answer it. Anyone can answer it. You deserve exactly what you have right now. Whatever it is, whatever your situation is, whatever your circumstances are, that is exactly what you deserve. Not a little bit more, not a little bit less. What you have right now is exactly what you've earned. If it was easy, you wouldn't even appreciate it if you got the success. Look at the people that have what they want without even earning it. They're miserable. And you want to be miserable? In fact, you should welcome the challenge. You should welcome the struggle, the grind, the hustle every single day. If you really want that, the ultimate goal, the ultimate passion, your vision, making it real, welcome the struggle. Because that's when you really start to appreciate your goals. That's when you really start to appreciate what it is that you want to accomplish. But you have to fight your devils. You have to fight them off. You have to push them aside. You have to be willing to say, I'm not going to fall for the distractions because there's so much out there. And everything's pulling you here, there, and the other way in. And maybe your family is saying one thing, and maybe your friends are saying something else, and your colleagues, and maybe, maybe everyone else is okay with your excuse for not making it to the top. But you cannot be okay with your excuse for not making it to where you want to be in your life. Because you have to be willing to take responsibility for what it is that you want. And you have to be willing to do what it takes to get what you want. Because life doesn't care about your excuses. Life doesn't care about your reasons why you can't make it. And everybody else might care. And your family and your brother and your sister and your loved ones, they might they might care about your excuses. They might say, yeah, that's a, there's a good reason. There's a good chance you won't make it. But you cannot care about it because life does not care about your excuses. Life cares about your results. And so should you if you want to reach the top. Achieving your goals is one thing, but achieving them against all odds is a whole nother world. How bad do you want it? Let me tell you right now that anything that you want in your life, anything that you want as part of you as a human being, as character traits, anything that you want, success, money, anything that is important to you in your life is not going to be an easy accomplishment. Anything worthwhile is not easy. Anything worth having does not come overnight. Anything that will be worth it to you will be worth the struggle.
Listen, there's a whole lot of people out there. There's a whole ton of people waiting to be successful. There's a whole lot of them. But I don't suggest that you join the waiting list for success because that's just an endless wish list of people saying, I want it. It is no longer enough to want it. You gotta go for it. That's the only way that you're going to be successful. And today, today you have to stand up and fight for your dream. Today you have to stand up and go and get what's yours. While everybody else is waiting, while everybody else is relaxing, wishing for it, wanting it, hoping for it, you gotta be out there making it happen every single day. If you wanna set yourself apart from the rest of the sheep herd, the rest of the people, mediocrity, average, if you wanna get away from all that and into success, doing great and really being fulfilled in your life, you have to step up. Step away from average. Step away from the 97% of the population. Understand that in order for you to be successful, you need to find success and get around it and spend as much time around it as you can. You have to learn from it. You have to be constantly learning from it. And that's the only way that you will really get to where you want to be. The formula to success is really, really, really simple. However, the journey, the grind, and the hustle is by no means easy. And so if you're going to get up and take it seriously, if you're really going to go for it, you have to get this straight through your head straight away. It's going to require all of you. Every little piece of you, that last bit of energy, everything that you have, all your resources, all your money, all your time, all your energy has to go in it, invest it into it. No other options, one way, and that's the only way. You want to make something big happen, it's going to take a while. You want something that's worth something to you, that's going to take effort, that's going to take hard work and dedication. Stop looking for the overnight success. Stop Googling, stop looking at Facebook. Stop checking all the shit that you don't need to be checking. Focus on what is important in order for you to get your goal. The easiest thing in the world is to be distracted. There are so many distractions out there. There's a billion of them. And being successful is very often all about deciding that you are not going to fall for the distractions. You have to be able to stay focused on your goal and to keep going every single day no matter how hard it gets. You are the only one that can make your life what you want it to be. There is no one else that is responsible for your condition. Look, if you want success in life, try taking some responsibility. The moment that you take responsibility for your life is the moment that everything shifts. Decide that you will not leave it up to anyone else. Not to school, not to your parents, not to your friends, not to your siblings, not anybody else. No one else is responsible for your success but you and that puts the power in your hands. But if you want things to go your way, take full responsibility. 
because that means you have the power to change it. It's up to you to make a difference. The power is in your hands. Now think about that for a second. That's all the power you need, the ability to impact and change anything. It's up to you. You have to switch out of that pity victim mentality and never look back. you have that absolutely no one else can tap into except for you. 